picture your nose in a sense, that impact, okay? If I get here, what we saw you on the video, and my nose gets going forward, so where it's actually in front of the golf ball, mm -hmm. and I have to come up and get out of it, and the yeah. shot's gonna come out low. So if I get that going here, yeah. see how low the ball flight is? Now, where I did that as I took you and I tilted you, and I got your head behind the ball, and I said a couple times, make sure you look at the back of the golf ball. So now that I have a tilt to my spine angle, and I get this shoulder behind the ball, so now the shoulder's on this side of the ball, and my eyes are back, so now I can then put my impact position up here. Now the ball will launch up into the air. Okay? So, your backswing principles are getting better, but we're not seeing the ball quite react the way we want it to. It's because we need to have you focusing on that black stripe a little bit more. Does that make sense? Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Did you all make a trip down to Piners? Well, we're going. Oh, yeah? Yeah. We've got to take this. Oh, good. I got him a Father's Day gift. The That's 13th, awesome. we're going to drive down. And Very cool. Drive. Well, if you go to the 11th hole, you'll see all my members because they're going to be marshalling the 11th hole. Oh, really? Oh, super. Yeah. Okay, good. Eyes tilted. Make a good turn behind the ball and let that right shoulder work more under as you come in through the impact area. Under. That's it. Start to see trajectory now. Again. You want the core of the body to move. Turn back. Finishing the swing. Don't stop yeah. and let this yeah, happen. Yeah, that's that's the thing that I, yeah. I fight. That chicken move. I hate it. <laughs> well, in a sense, what it happens is that you you're holding off to hit yeah. because it, you don't want it to go left. So the body stops and you're holding it off. If you just would trust it and continue to rotate and pull the club through and, and finish up this way, and and, and and that's okay. Yeah. I mean, Freddie Couples has had a very good career. A lot of them do. That's yeah. fine. I don't know if someone said that to you a while back. No, it just seems like every time I see a pro hit the ball, I just I notice his wrist how firm he is. got to get a sensation of when you get here, okay, that this is turning and you're feeling as if you're almost pulling the shaft of this golf club into the hitting area and you're staying behind it. Don't get here and don't feel like you're pushing because then the club gets going a little this way and then you've got to hold on to it and that's what you see. If this left arm can stay right against the side of your chest and as your body rotates and it pulls the arms, that's going to stay put and then the arm will, will rotate and pull more naturally. Shoulder turn back, turn, shift. <laughs> okay, now let's look at that. Again, we saw this, you got here in a great position, your body stopped and your hand went this way. Okay, this is what I'm saying earlier. If we stay here, continue to rotate. To give you a better understanding of exactly what causes this, let's say I sent you into town to go pick us up a pizza for lunch. As you came back down the highway, the car's doing 60 miles an hour. How fast is the pizza going in the front seat? 60 miles an hour. You slam on the brakes, where's the pizza go? Forward. Your body acts as the car. It controls the speed of the golf club. The hands and arms and clubs are like the pizza. As you get into impact, if you stop, that 
that's going to continue to go. This has got to continue to turn and rotate and control the speed. That's where when we talk about the golf swing, it's controlled from the body, the core of the body, out through the hands into the club. Don't try to don't try to move the club head. Have that control the speed. Okay, so go to the top of your backswing now and stop. Get your backswing really improved. Stay there. Now this is what should be feeling that's turning into the golf ball. See how I rotated your trunk? Okay. I want you to turn out of the way of the ball. There you go. Doesn't that feel like a strong launching oh, yeah. position? Leverage? Turn back, pivot. Nope, right idea. I think the biggest hurdle is understanding. Yeah. And you know, if you understand what makes the golf ball do what it does, then from there you can. Am I okay for it to lift from that? Yep. Or... Yep. Things that we look at when you're set up. And if you want to come directly behind the camera, things that you can keep an eye on is that if we drew a line straight down from your chin, your hand should be hanging right underneath your chin. That's there. And we've got a good flat back. I don't want to see a cup in this at all. Don't try to don't try to straighten your back out anymore. If I took a line from the shoulder to the hip, straight line there, that shaft of that golf club should be working just about as a right angle. And that's what establishes your swing plane. Stop. Stop. We rolled the hands.